Morning, good morning folks. I brought you back down to Pevensey Bay this week. We're going back for flats. Uh, the weather is slightly different to the last time we come down here, I must admit. It's uh, quite blowy, um, but I'm optimistic that we still be able to catch a few flatfish. Um, that is the plan. So join me on this session and I hope it's a good one. Right, so first bait's already been cast out. We're already out in the drink. Rigs we're using again then, same as we were using in the last session that we did. Just the, uh, the loop rig, I've got some ragworm on there at the minute. Clip down onto a yellow grip lead. The baits we're going to be using today are as follows. So I've got some sticky black ragworm in there. I've got some ragworm in here that I sourced from Tony's tackle yesterday. Hopefully they're all good to go. There we go. Lovely, yummy and juicy. Um, and then I've got a couple of bags of locally sourced razors, which are there. So we use them for tipping off once they've defrosted. Right, so hopefully it's a good session with lots of fish. I hope so, fingers crossed. Let's crack on. Good morning over there. How are we doing? Uh, good morning. How are we doing? All set up, ready to go? All good. Yeah. Just one rod at the moment, see how it goes. Awesome. Century fire blade. Lovely nice bit of kit, yeah, really nice. And you got the, is that the Pem Rival reel? It is. Yeah. Which I really like. Yeah, how are you getting on with it? Yeah, it's done me well. Done yeah. you all right, yeah? Awesome. So what are we going? What are we going for today? Going for place probably. Hopefully. I mean, it, see if it's going to work or not. But it doesn't look very favourable. The water looks no. pretty dark. To be fair, I've had a quick look down there. The water looks really coloured. Uh, so I think it's going to be dabs and flounder. Well, well flounder, I'll be happy with. Yeah, Hopefully, that was, my, that was my plan B. So yeah. See. Well, you never know, do you? So you never, you never know. know. It's, it's it's quite blowy today. It's quite windy. Yeah, it's, it's quite, quite windy. So I mean, we'll see how we get on. But yeah. It's looking like it's going to be an all right day. Hopefully we can just find those fish. Right, so it's not a blank. First fish in. A tiddly piddly little wine. Look at the size of that. Engulfed the ragwine bait. Let's get him back in. It's not fish at the minute. Nice wig. <laughs> oh man. Right, so we haven't had much luck on the worms, so I'm gonna do a bit of worm and razor fish on the bottom. Razor fish was a great bait last time we come out, so hopefully it will give us the trumps today. Right, so the target achieved just by changing the bait to the razor has brought us a lovely little dab. Nothing record breaking size, very, very thin, but a dab nonetheless get in. Right guys, so just managed a nicer dab, which is there. Oh, got the rig everywhere. There you go. The nicer sized dab, so they are coming out. Hopefully as the tide rises we'll be able to grab a couple more. So yeah, I'm pretty happy with that one. It's nice to see a fish. Uh, the session's been really, really weird today. Um, I thought it would be a little bit more prolific. Um, we would get quite a lot. Um, but we'll see as the tide comes up as to how it changes. Uh, we're just fishing in really, really close, just a short pop out, um, just with a two at flap, and now we're baited with the uh, with the razor fish. Razor fish seems to be the one that's doing the damage, and not have much luck on the worms.
Right on, so cliffs into a specimen sized rock then. Look at that for a rock then. Whoa, that's, that's a big one. Decent, that is. Oh, oh, oh. It's, it's, going to 20, 21, it's definitely not going to sit in my hand, is it? Yeah, look at that. Look at that for a rock then, man. It's a lively one. Oh, look at that. That is, a, that is a big old rock than that is, mate. That is a chunky one. <laughs> Happy days. Crazy. Yeah, 24 Rockland. That's a lovely Rockland that is, mate. Right, so so far it's going pretty slow to be fair. One white in and two tabs so far in an hour and a half. I'd say the water is pretty coloured. But I'm hoping that <laughs> it changes and we can catch some more fish. And it seems like I've been waiting forever to finally see a bite. I think I've just seen my first bite in about 40 minutes. The question is, will there be a fish? Let's find out. Let's have a look. Oh, lovely mate. That's what we're after. A nice spotty place. Well done Cliff. Right guys, so not much is happening for me on my end of the beach. It seems to be very quiet. I've had a couple of bites that I've missed. Um, I've even gone to the hassle of completely changing the rigs uh, to make sure that the hooks are ultra sharp and uh, still nothing on this side at the moment. Um, we're now at the top of the tide. Um, we're hoping that we can quite try and grab a couple more fish before the end of the session. Um, and that's about it really. Right on, folks, so I was about to give up all hope. <laughs> all hope. It's been absolutely, it's been about an hour since I had a fish, an hour and a half. And I've been graced with this beautiful white end. There we go. <laughs> it's getting back in. Right then, so the light starts to go. And my good old pals, the white end, come back in. There we go. This one's not too bad, it's bad of a size, actually. Two white end to add to the collection of fish today. There hasn't been very many, which I'm quite surprised about. But, uh, nevertheless, we're catching fish, and it's always good fun to catch some fish. Here we go then, will this be the onslaught of whiting? I think we're going to get hammered by pin whiting now.
Right, so we're another fish in. This time it is a rather plump rock then. There we go. Weird little things these are. Really weird. Really slippery and slimy. Let's get them back in. Come on, son. Bring us in a fish. And what have we got here? <laughs> there we go, dancing in the air. Right folks, we've got a couple more fish. The first fish is a whiting, which is there. And then we've managed to bag ourselves another dab, which is there. Happy days. Happy days. Hello mate, you alright? Hey! Look at that for a dab. Absolutely awesome. Beautiful. Get him on the ruler. Oh, you have to hold me ruler. Oh my god, he's flapping all over the place. That's a nice fish, mate. It's a nice one, yeah. Bit of meat on him. Yeah, he's a little bit over the zero. Yeah, that's a lovely fish, mate. Cracking sun. Happy days! Right, guys, so it's all starting to happen now. Double shot. <laughs> Crazy. Just when you got to pack up to go home, they all start coming out of the way. Absolutely crazy. There we go. Right, folks, so we're last cast in now. We'll be catching other fish. Only time will tell. Right, folks, so to conclude my session today, we reeled in two pin whiting. <laughs> I thought they'd gone. I honestly thought they'd gone, but they are around still. Um, Fishing-wise today, it's been hard work, white white here. Uh, fishing are tied up. Uh, not many fish at all, lots of pauses between bites. A um, couple of missed bites as well today, which was uh, quite strange. We'll have to get back to the rig-making board um, and uh, knock up some uh, fresh rigs with some fresh hooks. Uh, apart from that, fishing the tide out seemed to be a little bit more productive than the incoming tide. Um, and unfortunately, because we've got to go now, we'll never know uh, if there's any other bigger fish lurking out there. But don't forget to tune in next time and we will get back out there and try and catch some more fish. Thanks very much for watching. Cheers.